Hello friends, welcome back to Evel's Tech. Well, uh, today I've got something uh, new, uh, some different topic here, uh, not related to the Windows Server troubleshooting. Okay, this is regarding the Notepad++, one of the very famous text editor tool that we all have been using, right, for uh, log analysis and obviously to execute your codes. So uh, the other day I happened to, uh, you know do log analysis and I was trying to find a specific string in the logs and usually my tendency is to press the shortcut open the dialog box so what I do is I press ctrl F to get the dialog box and then I type the keyword to look into the logs but you see when I press ctrl F it, it prints some strange characters like ACK uh, let me show that to you again I press ctrl F I get this ACK I try it if you press ctrl S you get something like DC3 okay um, this is very strange nothing works i mean even if you try to close the tab using ctrl w right now uh, let me show that to you this is what it prints okay so i'm um, not exactly sure what happened here right i tried to uh, i also checked all the shortcuts okay they were intact i did not make any change to the shortcut here everything was in place so um then I researched a bit on this and then I found the problem was something else okay so basically uh, before doing the long analysis I had opened uh, I tried to open another log file which was a uh, very large in size around 4.65 gigs and then that file failed to open and it gave me an error okay so uh, that error was printed in a small window which remained open in the background and that's the this is the window that I'm talking about file is too big to be opened by notepad plus plus so while you have this window open and then pressing if you try to press any shortcuts with the main editor it will give you these strange results okay this is strange behavior however this is how the notepad plus plus work so to get around this simply click ok and then cannot open the file hit ok and then give a try ctrl f would give you the normal uh, find dialog box ctrl s would work and then if I do Ctrl W, obviously it will close this file as expected. Okay, so that is how um, I managed to get around this. Okay, um, that is all for this video. In case if I happen to get some more interesting topics, I will definitely share with you guys. Thank you very much, friends. Thank you for watching the video. And yes, please do subscribe and hit like. Thank you.